We're going to check and see if Visual Studio Code is installed on your computer. So here's what I want you to do. You're going to go to the very top right corner of your screen and you're going to select an icon that looks like a magnifying glass. It's pretty small, top right corner of your screen. Select that and it's going to open something called Spotlight Search. In here you're going to type Visual Studio Code and um, when you type Visual Studio Code if you get an icon that looks like this on the right side of that panel it should be installed on your machine so we're going to double click that and if you get a, a software package that opens up and looks like this you're done so uh, if this happens your computer has Visual Studio Code already installed on it so if that doesn't happen and you get um, something other than Visual Studio Code on the right side we're going to go back to Spotlight and we're going to type self-service and self-service is installed on your computer and you'll see an icon that looks like the uh, Navajo Prep IB logo we're going to double click that it will take you to self-service and then in self-service you're going to find and install uh, Visual Studio Code. I have an icon here that uh, shows what that will look like in self-service. So in self-service it looks about like this. So you'll click install. Notice it says install Visual Studio Code and it says code from Mr. Gordon for Mike Gordon's class so you'll install that and that's about a 300 megabyte install so it will take quite a while if you have a poor internet connection and it will be a fairly short install if your internet connection is good so make sure your computer is plugged in if you have a poor internet connection plug it in and just leave it run um, perhaps when you go to bed or overnight so it may take a while but you need to let it, let it run and install Visual Studio Code on your computer. Alright that should get it done when you get that installed so thanks and um, see you later. Bye.